Hello, hope you're doing good. In this video, I will be showing you how to hyperlink table of contents in Google Docs. The first thing I'll be showing you to do is how to create a table of content. Now, once you're on your Google document, as you can see right here, the first thing you want to do, you're going to simply select the titles that you would like to appear on your table of content. So for example, let's say we would like this to be one of the heading. All you'll need to do is simply select the text. After you have done that, you're going to tap right where you see heading on my screen. More than likely, you're going to be seeing normal text. Then from there, you can select heading 1 or heading 2. So I'm going to be selecting heading 1. After you have done that, you can scroll down. And then from there, for example, you could select heading 2 for the subheading. Then you can select heading 2 for the other subheadings. Then you would select heading 1 for any original title and then you can select heading 2 for the subheadings and you'll continue doing that so again you can see onboarding task list would be a heading 1 and then week 1 and week 2 would be a subheading so therefore it would be a heading 2 once you have done that all you'll need to do now is select where on the document you would like to place your table of content so let's say for example I would like to place my table of content at the top right here once you have selected the spot, you're going to simply carry the cursor to that spot. Then you're going to tap on insert from the top left hand corner of the navigation bar. Then at the bottom, you're going to see the option table of content. You're going to hover over that and you'll be provided with three different options. But since we want to create an hyperlink, we're going to be tapping on links. Once you have done that, you can see that it has been added right here. Now, if you would like to add the page numbers also, all you'll need to do is simply tap in the box where their table of content is currently in. And you're going to tap on the three dots beside the box. Then you're going to tap on more options. After you have selected more options, you're going to go over to the right hand column. And in the right hand column, you'll see show page numbers. You can simply tap on that and you can see that it is now showing the page numbers. And by the way, if you have heading 1, heading 2, and heading 3, and you'd like to add them all, you can select it right here. But I would normally recommend that you work with heading 1 for the main title and heading 2 for the subtitle, as you can see here. Now that we have created it, if we were to view it, so I'll go over to the top right hand corner, top where you see editing, and I'm going to select viewing. And you can see a sample of how it looks. So for example, if someone were to tap on who we are, you can see that it carries them to that section in the document. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.